Hello, and welcome back to Satisfactory. In our last episode, we looked at uh, making... We made high-speed connectors. No. Yes, we made high-speed connectors. Keep confusing them with circuit boards. And we talked about making some uh, fuel, some, some petroleum fuel here, in order to make... Um, in order to be able to use the jetpack. I think it'll be useful coming into our episode today because I'm planning on going on another exploration out into what's the new, what is the new Dune Desert area where there are quite a few hard drives uh, and we need those. So I'm going to give the jetpack a try if I can figure out how to use it. Uh, do you just... Oh, okay, you just hold down space to fly. Good. That's that's interesting. There we go. Okay, well, let's... Um, interesting. Oh, so you can only use one little pack of fuel to before you run out of flight here. I see. That's interesting. Well, it may not be super useful then, because we can't fly that high. <laughs> but we'll see. All right, I'm going to switch back to the Caterium shoes so that I can run faster. Uh, we need to stop by the space elevator. I think it's done. Actually, we could check and see if it's done, but I think it's done. Made the menu. Well, I'm over top of it now, so we can't see it. There are five left. There were five left not long ago. What's going on? Reinforced iron plates? Did I disconnect this already? I must have done something. Oh, I did. I disconnected one of these. Well, it's probably been sitting there for a while waiting for me. So I'll do that quickly. Uh, we can go pay a visit to a couple of things before we come, come back here and send the space elevator. Or send the payload up in the space elevator. I need to pick up some stuff for our trip here. I think these? Yes. We need some motors. Um, I want to get some concrete. I also want to trash a few things. We have coal. We could use that for fuel for the car. Um, I Oh, I need some rods. I want to trash... The extra, yeah. Okay, and I want to pick up some of these new high-speed connectors. So we have them, just in case. Here. I can probably just put these into trashing them. I can put them in here, and they'll get used. Probably don't need any wire. We have cable. A 51 cable. I think that'll be fine. Uh, just the concrete. Hopefully, the space elevator will be done when we get over there. Concrete's over here. I think like 400 of that. I want to have some supplies so that we can... A, build up to where we need to build up to to get at a hard drive. And B, to pay to use the hard drives. Um, let me see here. Did we do it? Did I do something else up? Or is it just time now? I think it's just time. One's probably on the belt there. Yes, it is. I guess we could d dismantle some of these things and feed them into the shredder while we wait. Because the space elevator is done. Unless the next update happens to come out while we're still playing this one. Which I don't see happening. Oh no, we have a box. A loot crate that we didn't need. 
do. Here we go. Ah, here they are. And then... There's something else. Ah, there they are. Yeah, it's just slow, and it was completely shut off, so it'll take a minute. Okay, more collecting of stuff. Creating of stuff. And we'll get out of here. The Explorer is downstairs where we built it the last time. Of these alien bits here. I think that's probably everything that I want to make sure that I get rid of. I have some extra concrete now. I think I'll leave the mushrooms behind. The nuts as a backup for food. Yeah, that looks... Uh, maybe those 15 copper sheets, too. I don't think we had anything going in the ma'am. No, and we can't do anything... Yet. Terium. Although we actually could. But I'd like to... I'd rather keep those... High-speed connectors as... Uh, material to, s to sell things, I guess, would be the... Wait, a way to word it? To sell to get the hard drives? Trade for the hard drives? So we can probably disconnect this and this. We got a lot more stuff to sell. You have what you need. Not quite yet. Maybe. Two more. There's one there. Yeah, you actually you do have what you need. Okay, well, let's deconstruct that. I'll let you have that one. Yeah, might as well. Okay, we can deconstruct all of these now. Probably could have done these before. Delete that, delete that, delete that, and delete that. Hopefully, no loot crates. There's a loot crate up there. Dang it. Okay. Because that one's coming from there, I'm going to rebuild it. The other one doesn't need to be rebuilt. I guess I could have used the jetpack. Wasn't there a loot crate here? Am I at the wrong spot? Didn't I see? Oh, there it is. Okay. So with, the, with this, you can kind of jump off and then catch yourself with it as you come down to the ground like that. Give yourself a nice soft landing. There, there, and there. No, you didn't. Oh, you jerk. Yeah. That's not that easy to use. I wonder if people aren't using it very much. I've seen. one way to do it. I think this will work out okay. Need to go a little bit higher. Be a little bit, I mean a lot of bit higher.
I don't... That's, that's such a weird bug. I want to dismantle the base elevator. That would be bad at this point. Who knows, it probably spawned the loot chest in the middle of the, sp of the sky. Where are we at? We're in the ground. Good. There. Are we laying now? Oh, okay. Okay, so what do we have extra here? Oh, I, should, I guess I shouldn't have picked up all those turbo motors. Or those motors. They're not turbo motors. Those would be good to get rid of. Get rid of that eight. And you are done as well. That can go. We must be full again. Yes, we are. I definitely want to... Oh, wait. Let me change out to my Katerium shoes here. Oops. Sorry about that. That... Well, you know what? Actually, let's do this first. Seal. And send. There we go. That was a weird uh, drawing bug there. It's splitting the thing there. The elevator. All right. Well, that is the end of <laughs> the end of the unlocks for now. And we have cleaned everything up. We go dump a little bit more stuff into this shredder. That these and I think that'll be good. Now, probably some more of this rubber. I want to minimize the amount of stuff that I'm carrying. Um, so that we have room for whatever we might pick up along the way. And some of this stuff is all getting made, so shredding it's not a big deal. And actually what I probably will do is hook some of those boxes up to a shredder so that they keep shredding and giving us points. Because now, other than building the next few products, we're on the home stretch. Um, gosh, I want to get rid of more of this stuff, but I don't. But we'll have the trunk in the car. I'm skittish about doing that a little bit because I may need to dismantle it in order to climb over stuff, or I may need to build ramps to climb over stuff. Uh, that is, uh, foundation ramps. So before we leave, let's look at the hub and see what we have. So we have bauxite, so that'll give us aluminum. And then advanced aluminum production gives us batteries, turbo motors, heat sinks, and miners mark three. The hazmat suit gets us into areas that have uranium, uh, which we need aluminum in order to make, and then nuclear power. Finally, uh, I think we need aluminum to make these things as well. They're just regular computers. Um, not specifically sure where the aluminum to use, but I'm pretty sure the aluminum is used in nuclear power. So we're just going to probably do these in order from left to right. Um, oh, turbo motors are probably used for something up here too, which require the aluminum mate to have. So uh, we're going to probably just work from left to right on tier 7 here, and then tier 8 uh, doesn't exist yet. It's weird how it doesn't clear the screen there um but we'll uh, we'll get this one going when we get back from our adventure here let me go over here and go downstairs and we'll get in our explorer and head out 
we're already about halfway through the episode, so the the exploration may end up being a um, partial or part of this episode, part of the next one. Uh, we'll see how that works out. With the explorer, would these can travel fairly fast? I guess I should have gone between the, the rows there, but this will work. Hello, my big friend. So, to get to the Dune Desert, from what I can tell on the map, we go in this direction somewhere. We don't go off the cliff. So the car itself does have health. And on top of the player's health, which we saw, I think, when I was driving around in the other vehicle, the uh, the sugar cube, the, the tractor. And then sometimes little rocks really disrupt your flow here, and but hills and stuff do not. Kind of a weird thing with the uh, car. Maybe we'll go this way. And there's bees here, but kind of a who cares. That's a interesting look looking landslide thing there. Kind of pretty cool there. There's a uranium rock. Maybe we give it a little bit of birth here. And I think this is where we were at the beginning of a few episodes ago with the, um, when I it didn't done my last exploration. And that's going to be hard to get back up. There's one of the hard drives that I already looted. So if we continue down this sort of chasm here that we started building over way back when, the very first episode, maybe the second episode, that's cool looking. The ye the yellow orangey looking pieces there. We go this way. And this way. There's kind of like a weird natural roadway here. That's kind of what I'm following. And this is the entrance, I believe through the dune desert. There should be a hard drive right around here someplace. Probably up there. Um, car? I'm not driving. That's weird. Let me see here. Can I see a hard drive? Is this where that one is? The first one is. If, if I'm correct, it's up on one of those rocks. And it might just be worth it to... Try and fly up. See, I can't even get enough height here out of the... to not fall and hurt myself. So, I think we're going to have to resort to building up. But the the jetpack really isn't all that useful for anything except maybe using when we fly up to see where our... Um, where things like our, our, our bus is so we can connect things to it. So we're going to have a lot of Fortnite-style uh, exploration here, I guess. That way, and this way. It's a good thing I brought lots of iron plates and rods.
Oh, well, there's a purple slug up there. I wonder if I'm in the right spot. I bet you I'm not. It's on one of these, one of these pillars. Or is it? Actually, it might not be. It might be on the ground. Which would be kind of horrible. But I think since we're here, I might as well build up to that slug. Get it? Do a straight walkway. Want too high? I can go this way. Then I can go this way. Ha ha! You can't fart on me, plant. Being very careful to not... Okay, where is it? If the purple slug is there, it's over there a little bit somewhere. Is that it right there? Am I that far off? No. It's here somewhere. There's a doggo. Well, I don't see it. I know it's here, but I, I don't see it now. So it must be... It's around these little... These tree-looking things. Another slug down there. A yellow one. Maybe it's... Maybe it's underneath some of these rocks and I just can't see it. But we will try to find it. Hard drive exploration is one of the funny things in this game because you can spend so much time... Oh, uh, get off the one you're doing to dismantle, Wally. Hopefully I don't leave a loot crate way up in the sky someplace, because that would be annoying. Maybe I should put some stuff in the trunk of my car, just so that I have less in my inventory to, to combat the... the the dismantle bug, or the mass dismantle bug. That might be a good idea. And then this one, and then we're done. Let me put some stuff in the car. Um, maybe some of the extra stacks of stuff. Definitely that. Uh, well, I don't have that many extra stacks of stuff, I guess. You and you. That'll at least help. Let's see if we can drive into that little area there. You're able to climb some of these pieces here like this. Oh look, there's a bee flying around. Drive into here. It's somewhere near these tree things. But maybe it's just laying on the ground and I was mistaken. Yep, there it is, laying on the ground. Would you look at that? Okay, well, we have some spitters. Well, I can at least use the car as a shield. Oh, well, I had one, yeah, one bullet left. I did reload. Come on. Gotcha. 
shot you, but you shot me anyway. Industrial beams. Oh, look, there's some there's some nuts down there. Copper wire. Can I get up this way? Some of these things that look like they're not a sheer rock that are are kind of annoying. There we go. Here and here, lots of stuff. I love collecting stuff. Oh, hello. Little friend. They've gotten, like, be, be afraid lately. Like, they run away. They just kind of run and hide. Wait, is this a big one? He's not doing the usual bull stomp thing. Come on. Yeah, it must be a big one, because it took me so many hits. Three carapaces. Yep. It's a big one. Okay. You just need... Oh, you need power, too. Okay. Powered is... Powered is biomass burner. Funny that I picked up 15 of those things there. And it needed 27. Ma'am. Our drive and go. Alrighty. I guess that's all the junk there was laying around. There's usually more parts and pieces and stuff. There probably are. They're probably up on the thing there. Maybe that's what I was thinking of. I don't know. Uh, let's see. There are... There's nothing else there. Let's get back in the Explorer and go to the next hard drive. There's another uranium rock there. There's that yellow slug. I'm not going to worry about it. The only reason I got the one that I got was because we were so up. Already so far up there that I wanted to at least make all that building worthwhile. There's another factory. Come on, write yourself. There you go. Magic. Okay, so we'll continue in here. We need to go a little bit southwest, or east rather. Up these steps, maybe? Uh, no, I think we can go on the side of it. The good thing about driving the Explorer for exploration is none of the critters will bother us, and we can run them over. And it's fine. It might be in the poison field. Oops, I got hung up on the edge of the cliff there. Down here. No, I think it's up in the poison field. So I think one of the things with the with the um, poison is you can't actually Yeah. Oh you can in the car. That's weird. Or I just have to be either right on the edge of it there. So we need the gas mask on. I didn't bring all that many gas masks, though, which was foolish of me. Could have made some more. Hopefully we can find this thing quickly. In the middle here. There it is. Hopefully it doesn't require too much effort. Or any effort whatsoever. There. Look around maybe for some bits and pieces laying on the ground. Here's some bits and pieces. Ooh, snack tree. There. There. Ooh, radio control unit. That's fancy. We haven't made those yet. I think we can finally now, but we haven't yet. Like I said, I don't want to be too wasteful on the uh, filters, but we haven't even used one yet. So, our whole one yet, so I think we're okay. This isn't all... Like, you can kind of tell when the color changes, whether I'm in the crud or not. 
Wow, there's two uranium rocks right there. Three. Yeah, that's going to be a bit of a hassle to go through. <laughs> uh, let's see. You can have some of this stuff. Oh, that's good. I can use the batteries as power. Put this stuff in here then. Uh, do, 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 do. You can have the bits and pieces. Ooh, lots of copper wire. I figured we'd get a lot of that. There's a lot of that usually. Okay, let's roll. No, let's... Can we drive? Thank you. Yes, I know. Fix the property damage. Yes. Okay, so the next one is... Further in this direction, but I think we're going to have to go the other way to get to it. That's a big spitter. Because of the poison field. It's on the other side of the poison field. We'd go around, I think, and get to it. It might be the last one we end up getting. No, I think it actually won't be. We need to get it first. Or soon. We just may need to drive off a cliff. So up here, these are some of the trees that you can actually get to in this, uh, yeah, Sparty plants. I see you. And I just rolled the car. Okay. Straighten yourself out. There we go. Uh, these are some of the trees that you can actually get to and, and chop down. In the, in, in the dune desert, like, there's not a whole lot of choice. You know what? These are rare enough lately. I'm gonna get the fruit. So, south isn't quite the direction that I want to go. I want to go more eastward, but maybe we can drive... Ooh, maybe we can drive down here to the coast and get to that next hard drive. Oh, really? It's a rock. A lot of slugs out here, at least. So if we end up wanting to do a bunch of overclocking and we can't find enough slugs, we can always come back out here and get them. There it is. I just saw it. Now, who's out here on the island? Big spitters. We may have to uh, throw some noblis at them. Let me see about that. Can I throw it far enough? Not quite. Almost, but not quite. The good thing is, is they can't shoot in water. Can I drive across this water, or is it too deep? How does that work with the explorer? Does it, I hope someone... Someone's probably yelling at the screen right now. Don't do it. Don't drive across the water. Yeah, it throws me out of the car. Oh, no. All right, you yelled at the screen, and I didn't hear you. Uh, let's see. Organization, personal storage box. Store everything I can in there. Take everything I can out of there. And then build a new one. <laughs> uh, explorer. Okay. Went in that direction. That way I remember not to go that way, right? Do, do, do. Oh, come on. Yes, I know you can use those as fuel. I would like you to use the kind of fuel that is the most f fuelless uh, as, as you can. So maybe if I kind of go out a bit. If I do a run... Leap. Throw. No, that didn't work. Oh, I, I know why. I didn't aim up high enough. Run. Kind of. Maybe I'll just try the rifle here. Can I snipe them enough? I don't know if I'm hitting anybody. I also don't have that much ammo. These, this rifle really eats through the ammo. I don't think I'm hitting anybody. I 
I can't tell if it's doing any damage or not. Well, let's go all crazy then. Actually, you know what? I will do. I will build a bridge. I will build a foundation bridge. And then I will build... I will do some more novelisks. That didn't go far enough. I don't know if it's doing any damage or not. That one definitely should have. But I can't tell if it is. Oh, that one took damage to the near guy. Definitely he's taking damage. They can't they can't target me because I'm cheating here a little bit. Oh, now they can. Oh, there's only an orange one. Still do, does damage to me, but they're only orange ones. Uh no. dead. That one's a green one. Definitely hit him that time. And now he's dead. I use your sword. That. And you're over here in the water. Oh. Okay, well that's uh, some... I would call them advanced, but it's me. So there's some fighting techniques. With some of the later game stuff that you can use. And what do you require? 50... Oh no, 10. That's 10. I have it put 50 in the slot. Okay. It's not too bad. Yeah, I got everything. There might be some junk up there, but I'm not going to bother with that. Dismantle and go. Go. I don't see any loot crates. Okay. Uh, next hard drive. Sorry about that. Get back up off of the coast. We need to go back up the way we came. I guess I should drive down the roadway there instead of through the roughage. That would be the wise thing to do. But yeah, we have so many slugs we haven't even bothered doing any overclocking, really, yet. We overclock one thing. And so I'm not going to worry about uh, picking up all the slugs. Okay, so here's our lake. We can go along the lake. Wow, there must be some... Oh, I think there's a summer sloop or uh, whatever they are in the middle there. Which are useless right now, so... Let's not go off the cliff. That was a cliff I thought I was going to have to drive off of. But I didn't. I realized, or I noticed, so there was that ramp. Car is kind of loud. Like, oh no! I just ran over a berry bush. That's no good. But uh, from what I've seen, starting in the uh, this 
empty desert area is a bit rough because there's not a whole lot of biomass available. Okay, so we've made it that way. And then up here someplace... And one of these... You can actually climb these cliffs a little bit like that. And one of these little rock outcroppings, there should be another hard drive. Build a ladder. Maybe? Oh, it's down there. Oh, there it is. Okay. That's gonna be fun to get. Good. Hey, look, it didn't crash. Okay, let's go this way. Maybe there's a easy way up there? No, my last easy day was yesterday. Hello, there's a spitter. Maybe I can do it building style here. Snack tree. Okay. So it is... I've lost my orientation. Is it up there? It is up there. Okay, we'll do this one. And then... These. I'm really bad at aiming these things in the right time. And We need to turn. I didn't give myself a near enough space to climb this. A couple more, and then I will turn and, and switch back. turn again and just head straight over and this one's stuff is all floating in space well not all of it the screws are and the in case industrial beams were super computer nice 35 turbo motors or motors they're not turbo motors Wally Here we go. There. Okay, I think that's all the junk laying around. But this is where we're going to leave it today, because I just looked at how long this episode is, and that's more than long enough for an episode. So I think I will probably just drive to the next... Uh, the next hard drive off camera which is not very far away actually it's out in the middle of the desert over there um and then uh that'll be the next that'll be where we pick up for the next episode so thank you all for joining me and i will see you next time bye for now